Good morning and welcome to PLZ Soccer. This is your Scottish News Bulletin. Celtic manager Brendan Rodgers has said he will only sign more players if they have genuine quality. Celtic have already made three signings this window and could be set to announce another in Andrew Gutman, but they remain in the market for another defender. Of course, you'll always wait for quality. I think that's, the, that's what's important for us. We, if you're going to bring in any players, they have to be of, of real genuine quality, but they also have to be able to enhance our group. Like I say, there's, there's no point in us bringing in players that's just going to uh, just add to the players that we really have. They have to really be able to make a genuine difference. Kilmarnock boss Steve Clark is happy to run with what he already has if he cannot add to his squad before the transfer window closes next week. Greg Stewart spent the first half of the season on loan at Killy to great success, but has since moved to Aberdeen via his parent club, Birmingham. Killy sit third in the Premiership and they host second place Rangers tomorrow. Scotland women's team lost 2-1 to Iceland in a friendly yesterday, but manager Shelley Kerr remained upbeat, saying her side have learnt a lot. Kerr said the two friendlies over the past week, both of which have been defeat, have been used to experiment different players and formations in preparation for their work. first ever World Cup this summer. And Hibernian have announced the signing of Genoa midfielder Stefan Omionga on loan until the end of the season. The player said a presentation of what is expected of him helped sell him on Easter Road and he'll go straight into tomorrow's squad to face Motherwell. And I'll give you a quick run over the Tuesday morning papers. The record claimed French club Nice will bid £8 million for Alfredo Morelos to replace Mario Balotelli. The Sun have Steve Clark telling his players not to get wound up by the controversial Colombian forward and the Daily Mail focus on Celtic's pitch rot. Thank you very much for watching and stay with us on PLZ Soccer where as always we'll bring you the latest football news from Scotland and beyond and the football show is of course on tonight at 6 o'clock.